Hello and welcome to a new video about programming Arduinos. This time we are going to talk about remote controls. Uh, remote. We want to control our Arduino with the help of a remote control. Well, there are several types of remote control. You know, there are remote controls which uh, send out an ultrasonic sound. Okay, and the receiver is receiving this ultrasonic sound of a specific frequency and then knows which button has been pressed. Yeah, and then there is the usual way of infrared, so infrared sound, infrared signals, light signals in infrared spectrum. This is a very usual variant. Uh, the disadvantage of this infrared signal is that you have to aim to your receiver. Okay, so you have, you have to, you know, there must be side contact between the receiver and, and the infrared signal clear, huh? because if there is no side contact, then no light can be received. Uh, however, it needs less power. Huh? Then these ultrasonic devices, they needed to be bigger and have bigger batteries and so on. But however, it also worked from another room. And in latest time, we also have a bunch of, of radio frequency remote control, for instance, Bluetooth remote controls and so on. However, the majority, still the majority, are those uh, infrared remotes. Okay, And we have one infrared remote inside. Uh, you can see here there is a little, there is a little diet, yeah, this infrared diet, and we also have this. This is an infrared receiver. How is this working? Well, this infrared signal has a specific frequency. It's 38 kilohertz. Okay, 38 kilohertz flashing. Yeah, we can. If the remote control, if you activate your remote control, you have to remove this. And if you press the button, can we see it in the camera? Yes, slightly, a little bit. Yeah, you see, there is this, there is this light. It can only be seen. It can only be seen in with the camera. Yeah, with the bare eye, you do not see anything because our eye is not sensitive at this infrared frequency. So this infrared light here is flashing at 38 kilohertz, and it's modulating a pulse width modulation. So every button has a specific width of this 38 kilohertz bursts. All right? So the, the light is infrared. Yeah? The light is infrared and we have here... We have here then... First nothing, then we press the button then the light will be turned and off, on and off very fast, yeah, with 38 kilohertz. So this is some sort of burst. And the length of the burst So this is the time T, yeah, and this is the light. Here we have 38 kilohertz and here the length of this pulse here the code is hidden okay so whenever we press a button here we produce a different length of code all right and this infrared receiver here is receiving this uh, different length of code and we have here three different three different pins. Okay, so our infrared receiver has here three connectors. One is labeled G, one is labeled R, one is labeled Y. Why? 
G is ground. So to G we are connecting ground. R is power supply. So here we are connecting plus 5 volt. Uh, uh, red. Uh, memorize red. And here we do have then the signal. All right. Here we are receiving the code. So if we want to connect this to our Arduino, we just have to use this type of cable. Well, and then we said G is ground. Yeah, we we'll use the brown one for ground. Then we have red, and then we have the signal. Okay, and these things we have to connect to our Arduino. Uh, which we never used here in this picture, five. Uh, so here's the Arduino. Okay, still in picture. Uh, move it a little bit further like this. Good. Uh, here's the Arduino. So we need to have plus and ground, so plus 5 volts, and ground here, I go in, go in, ground, and here we are going to use pin number 5. Huh? Because I've drawn the connection picture already, and of course I want to have this fit. This is the hardware setup, okay? And then we should be able to receive signals from our remote control. Yeah? And, yeah, this will be done in next video, right? So next video we're going to program this. Yeah? We will also use a, a library for this. Yeah. Next video, programming infrared receiver and receiving commands from a remote control. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.